Hey guys, welcome back to another Before You Buy video and this time we have the Liu La Boom Draw with the very first legendary Peacekeeper skin inside of Call of Duty Mobile. So we are going to take a look at everything that you should know before you buy the draw. So you can decide whether you are going to buy this draw or skip it. Before we start the video, we should be talking about the odds of the items inside of this lucky draw. Now remember, these odds are for the very first spin. The legendary Peacekeeper MK2 has an odd of 0.08 as usual. And the Death Angel Alice Unchained Punk skin has an order of 1.25%. Here is the best part, the DLQ 33 Punk Power has an order of 4%. As you can see, the DLQ has very low odds compared to other items inside of this lucky draw. Then surprisingly we have a spray with very low odds that is 4.67% of chance and the fire dancer has a 5.5% chance. The sticker has an odd of 6.5%. Soliciting in Solace, calling card has an odd of 10%. Surprisingly we have muscle car with very high odds that's 11%. And most of you guys will get either the cluster grenade pump power or the baseball bat pump power. In your very first spin because we have odds of 28% and 29% respectively for them. So type in the comment section what will be your favorite item except the character skin and the peacekeeper. When we talk about Peacekeeper, we should be talking about the Mythic Peacekeeper as well because this legendary Peacekeeper is going to compete with the Mythic Peacekeeper. So let's see a side by side comparison of these two weapons. What I really want to compare is the Iron Sights. As you can see, the Mythic Peacekeeper Iron Sight is unbeatable in my opinion because it really doesn't cover your view. The legendary Peacekeeper is not that great when it comes to the Iron Sight. However, I like the design of this legendary peacekeeper because it feels alive using the legendary peacekeeper. For example, it is so colorful, it's so reactive, with horns and everything, it looks like some kind of a truck that has become a gun. If you take a closer look at the legendary peacekeeper, you can see this gun comes with four reactive effects. The first one is the base effect and it has no effect at all. But when you get two kills, the pipes start showing some smoke. When you get four kills, the colors start getting bright and bright and the smokes become a little more intensified. When you get six kills, however, what happens is that the gun looks like it is about to explode. But it's still, the yellowish orange color of the Mac remains the same. Finally, when you get eight kills, you can see the color of the gun totally changes and it becomes really really bright. I think they have done a really good job when it comes to the reactive effects of this gun. I can't complain about that. It is absolutely beautiful. The character skin on the other hand is also very detailed character skin. You don't have a lot of skins for Death Angel Alice but all the skins we have are very unique to its own theme. In this draw also there is no difference. They have literally made a punk out of this character skin. We have chains, we have so many colors, we have belts, masks, what not. This character skin is just great, I love it. What do you guys think about this character skin? Leave a comment in the comment section. If we talk about other items inside of this lucky draw, we have this emote called Fire Dancer and it's a really cool emote. I bet most of you all will definitely use this emote a lot. And here is the sticker which has very high odds and it's crazy. The muscle car is great but instead of a muscle car, if it was a truck skin, I think it would look really cool. And there we have the cluster grenade punk power, the calling card, the baseball bat which is required to get the weapon set along with the legendary peacekeeper and here is the new legendary spray and here is the DLQ 33, the third most rigged item inside of this lucky draw. And if you get DLQ early, you can consider yourself very lucky. So that's everything that you should know before you buy the draw. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you like, subscribe if you haven't yet, watch my other videos and I will see you guys in the next one.